Okay, so much for the Power's off, except for that console. It's damp in here, too. I hope the water hasn't corroded anything I need. Genetic profile confirmed. Greetings, Dr. Sobeck. Do you wish to activate Recluse Spider? I do. Activating. Okay, powering it up. That doesn't sound good. It appears to be unstable. At least I've got power. And there's data here. Looks like this recluse spider thing is a testing apparatus for Gaia and Hades. I'd better take a look at that excess panel. Yes. Get to it. Okay. I think those circular pods are repositories. One loaded with Hades backups. The other with Gaia. What are you waiting for? Hades is down, but the Gaia repository is stuck. So unstick it. I need to detach the cable from the arms coupling. Yeah, what the fuck have I been trying to do? down. I should be able to act. I got one. Two, in fact. I was starting to get worried. Data footprint low. 90% memory free. That can't be right. Guy was a vast super intelligence. He barely expected us. without sub-functions, but there are sub-functions out there. The original ones. Scattered to the winds when Gaia blew herself up. They could be anywhere. You can't find them in time, even if you did. The mysterious signal mutated them just like Hades. You have no idea. I do. A good one. If it works. You found the nerve, but it won't connect. It's close. Mountains west of Plain Zone. Close enough for me to go get it. I was hoping to find all the subfunctions, but one's enough to get started, right? It is. Recover Minerva. One could use it to launch Gaia's heuristic matrix. When she's conscious, she helps me find the other subfunctions. I go gather them. And rebuild her piece by piece. Very clever. Still think I can't save the world on my own? Nope. Nope. You can't. Ah, yes, well. About that. Alert! Intruders! Alert! Aloy. I need you to listen closely. These intruders want the same thing you do. Gaia reborn. It's why they're here. Friends of yours? No. They don't know me. 
The data Pulse I transmitted indicated that a Gaia backup could be recovered here was anonymous. Now, they're very powerful, but they won't harm you. Not when they see who you are, what you are. A clone of Elizabeth Sobek, a genetic key with which they can reboot Gaia and rebuild the system. They need it. I warned you, Simons. For once, Eloy, submit to the inevitable. Open the hatch. First I rebuild Gaia, save life on Earth, then I track you down and end yours! I'm trying to help you here. Try spying on me with that. There. New focus, spyware free. Okay. Think. Think, think, think. I don't care how powerful they are, the only thing that can open that hatch is me. The question is, can I find another way out? You shouldn't, but you're going to find because this is not much, but maybe it's a way out. Genetic profile confirmed. <laughs> Doctor Sobek, please step inside. <laughs> These are the real ones. They had like a colony or something, maybe out of space or shit like that. Or they are the Pharaoh Zen, whatever. Do we have it? Did the pulse originate here? Has someone... Something wrong? Shit! Spectres, Beta! Any idea what the hell a clone of Elizabeth Sobek is doing here? Maybe Gaia made one when it destroyed itself a Hail Mary to repair the system. Mm hmm. Don't like the sound of that. Nah, don't like it. Don't want it. But the if it. Nope. One's enough trouble. Eric! Yeah? Care to do a little downsizing? Hmm. Sure. What if she sent the pulse? Then that was foolish of her. But we got what we came for. So let's put it to use. Is the Trinity? I snap a lot of necks in VR. But that certain tremor as life fades from the eyes. Ooh! No hollow quite gets it. Keep flapping your mouth. It makes a nice target. You actually think that primitive crap you got there can hurt me? Yes. The worst was thinking as well. Look at him. This is gonna be fun. I yeah, know this is definitely not going to be fun. Definitely not. I really don't want to start when. He's like from space, man, basically an alien compared to me. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Is there anything over here? Pain makes you feel alive. What? I'm not hurting him. I need a way out of here. I gotta tell you, 
This is far. I can switch it up. What? He can even see me through that. This kills all mine. Stupid fuck man. I'm sorry my guy. I'm playing against you on hard man. You almost But ha have you at least realized what I'm up to man? Apparently not. You're a fucking idiot, man. I don't care how smart your technology is, you are a retard. Going to use him. This thing's got a few couples holding it up. We need to cut them off. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Why in the fuck? I'm going to die. Because there are multiple portions that look exactly the same. Two more couplings on the stem. Fight me! Not that dumb machine! Of course, there has to be one more. Stupid fucking shit, man. Tag him. Yeah, get the fuck out of here, man. Where's the other one? Thank fucking God, man.
What was that? Me killing what you wanted dead. What the hell did you think? The platform collapsed, body went with it. Right. And since when don't you get what you want, huh? Spectres, search. Where's some air? Is there anywhere air? No, there isn't. I wanted to see. Oh, so basically it's... Shit. Barely enough for her to survive, okay. now I have to get over here man where I don't have no go on the platform how to get out of here I love this development that now there are some super humans or not super humans but very advanced humans, man. Amazing, man. I'm curious who, uh, who they belong to. But they seem to be using normal ammunition, which is a bit weird in my opinion. And I have to say it was funny how she cut off silence like a little bread man. And I don't like silence. But you can clearly tell that he's smarter, not necessarily smarter. But he has different knowledge than her. Looks like some kind of power room. Current slate here. Promising. I'm sorry, but nothing about this is promising, man, because we have no health, nothing left, man. If we don't find anything, man, we are fucked. And they looked amazing, man. What, it's already completed? You, you, nope, it's not perfect. Where you wanted to go, girl? Ooh, ooh, that happened to me once, man. That sucks, man. Being caught by a current and dragged under some leaves, man. Uh, a tree. 
That sucks, man. I thought I was going to drown, man. Yeah, that sucks. And the guy. Shh. It's okay. I'm here. I've... The guy you didn't want to come with you, he saved you, hmm? And I thought you're doing everything alone, hmm? I've got it. Die, bitch. And wake up with a better character, man. Hey, hey, easy. Easy there. Hey, 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 it's right here. And the way you were clutching it when I found you, I knew it was important. Where are we? An outpost of the Utaru tribe. Not far from where you fell. How long? Two days. Aloy? There's no time. I found something. In the mountains west, west of Plains Song. Yeah. Kept muttering it while I carried you. Look, Aloy, whatever it is that you found, you're in no shape. To... I will cry. Just hit her. If I have to. Okay, hit, fine. Hit her. Just hit her. Before you do that, there's someone you should talk to. An Utaru named Zo. And she told me there's been trouble in those mountains. A cave spitting out deadly machines. Can't be a coincidence, right? Well, why do we need her? Let's head for the cave. It's in Utaru territory. Her territory. She can help us. You'll see. Then why do we need her? Look at her, what has become of her, man. Fine. Let's go see this marvelous so then. As with I mean, Elo never let herself get pushed around. She was always who she was. And yeah, she was a bit bratty or however you want, but she wasn't like this huge bitch, man. Snow, still the seed rises as certain as so she should be in bed. Aloy doesn't really do should. You're so right. Verl said I should talk to you about the machines in the mountains west of Plainsong. I am a grave singer. My place is here. We can talk once you've healed. What's wrong with it? Her. The name is Ray, not it. She's one of our land gods. And she's dying. But not just dying. She's suffering. Her condition is not your concern. So, if anyone can help, it's Aloy. May I? But she looks amazing, man. Almost real. So what I'm about to do might look bad. But it will help. Spear. Mm -hmm. 
The mountains. West of Plainsong. There trouble out there? The Otaru have trouble everywhere. Our fields blighted, our settlements abandoned. But the cave in the mountains is the worst of it. It is a sacred place. Fa, another of our land gods, went inside weeks ago, but she hasn't emerged. Killer machines pour out instead, threatening to overwhelm us. It's never happened before. Wouldn't be your first sacred cave. Oh my god, man. Thanks for taking us in. Varl's the one that carried you across the wild. I doubt anyone else here would have let us in. Or stayed by my side to make sure Aloy was comfortable. We were lucky to find you. I could say the same thing. Sounds like you two have been spending a lot of time together. Yes. I wish it hadn't taken an injury to make that happen. I hope you feel better. And soon. I don't. You said the tribe has trouble with its fields and settlements. Yes. Whereas once the land gods harvested endless bounty from the fields, now they sow a poisonous blight. War brews among the Tanakh, so their rebels prowl our outskirts. And the machines grow ever more aggressive, hemming us in, forcing us to desert distant villages. Now they're even coming out of our sacred cave. Many in the tribe fear our days are dwindling. I wish I could tell you it was better everywhere else. Not that we're gonna lose hope. Look, I would have lost hope if I knew this wasn't a game. Ray and other machines like her, you call them gods? Land gods, yes. For generations, they provided for us. Seeding and harvesting the fields of Plainsong. Food for all. A miracle of endless bounty. A farm run by machines. More than a farm. A blessed land providing sustenance for my people until the derangement. So what happened to the land gods after the derangement? They faltered year by year. Once they were peaceful, now they turn on us when we approach, even attack us. They'd always enrich the soil, but for several seasons they've glutted it endlessly with mulch. The fields have turned fetid. A blight that keeps spreading, even beyond our lands. We used to have food for all. Now we... We barely have enough to feed our children. Must be over fertilization. Spread by spores, maybe? I don't know. That's not even the end of it. Each land god used to visit the sacred cave once a year, but no longer. Without the rituals of renewal, they've fallen apart. Like Ray. They're dying. And my tribe with them. So the cave is sacred because machines like Ray and the one you call Fa go inside? Yes. Before the derangement, each land god left the fields and made a pilgrimage to the cave. Always in the same order. Do first, then Ray, then... Do Ray. So on. <laughs> Spattered with soil from their neighbors. Each reappeared two days later, shining anew. Without so much as a scratch. Soil and ornaments of worship washed away. The tribe celebrated each return as one of the eight hallowed festivals of our calendar. But the derangement changed the cycle. Yes, or so we thought. Over time, the land gods stopped the ritual, becoming crazed and brittle. But three weeks ago, Fa trudged inside. The entire tribe lifted their voices in song praying that the cycle had begun again. Fa has not emerged. What has our machines built to kill? Are machines being made inside? 
Like in the cauldron? Sounds like it. But the way these land gods come and go, it's not like anything I've seen before. You called yourself a grave singer. What does that mean? She thinks that someone's grave. Living things and end must come. The fuck? It is my task to ease the passage. I try to bring comfort and sing of the renewal that death sows the way for. But I never thought I would have to sing for one of our land gods. I don't even know if Ray hurt me. What you did soothed her more than I ever could. It's not your fault, so. And without the second sight, there's nothing more you could have done. I need to get into that cave. What? No one does that. Well, it's time to make an exception. It belongs to the land gods. Look, so. There is something inside there. Something that could solve problems all over the world. The storms, the derangement. <laughs> Maybe even your broken land gods. What could possibly do all that? A spirit? Yeah. Something like that. I could journey back to Plainsong. Assemble the chorus. Tell how you soothed Ray. Ask their permission to go inside. Great. I'll get my things. She needs rest. You don't have to tell me. I'm fine. At the end, how funny would it be if Elo is completely alone because she has turned anyone away? <laughs> Assembling the chorus will take time. Heal first, then join me. Fine. Bed rest. I got it. What a comfy bed that is. She does not need you to help her heal. You could come with me to plain song. Lend your voice to mine as I try to persuade the chorus. It might help her cause. I'd like to. But I'm afraid she might run off. Really? And, and they're talking exactly there as if she couldn't hear, like, and she has to. Like, <laughs> come on! Come on, Gorilla Man, you are better than this! Come on! Come on, this is kiddie shit, this is uncharted level of BS, man. Don't, please don't become another naughty, please don't, please, please, please don't. I, my heart can't handle it, man. I can't handle another naughty dog, man. Destroying a beloved franchise, man, I can't. Very well. Later then. So, wait. It's not uh, that I don't want to go with you. It's just that I... Yes! <laughs> yes, bro! Is that what you were trying to say? Um... Yes. <laughs> And I look forward to more conversation. So does Valve, trust uh, me. Yeah, me too. <clears throat> You're supposed to be resting. Laurel, you should go with her. I'll get better on my own. You trying to get rid of me so you can... <sighs> this time I'll meet up with you in plain song when I'm ready you sure about this yes go <laughs> get out of here okay 
So, wait. That was quick. And man, man, is a stash close by? No. Fuck this bullshit. Yeah. I definitely need to take a break. Oh my god, I wanna check everything out. There's a workbench, right? Uh... Fuck it, let's check the, just this place out. Can't stop it. <laughs> Ever since this g game released, but I've been pretty much. <laughs> I can send it to my stash. I have pretty much been playing, man. Somehow it's docile. Part of its programming, maybe. Another outlander strutting around like she owns this land. Are you buying or selling today? Oh, here I, I ex okay, 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 okay. First of all, let's restock everything. Then I cannot Air take. You are so lucky that I cannot kill you. Did you hunt? Tools, I fast travel, smoke bomb. How many do I have? I don't know, but I don't care. Buy back? From who? We should trade. A brighter day! Where are we actually? I need to meet Varl and Zo in plain song. Ask the chorus if we can go into their sacred cave. Minerva should be inside. If I can get it, I can reboot Gaia. And, and maybe we can figure out who those strangers in the Proving Lab were. But first, I might want to explore a little. See what I can find in this area. Okay, strange. I thought we would be in a completely different place. What is that supposed to be? Those signs here on the ground, man. Oh, maybe this is that. This I'm starting to stutter, man. Fuck me. Maybe this other the areas where the machines plant. Maybe it's a real farm with different. Might be. But we'll see. I definitely am kinda glad that there isn't a big city, a lot of to discover because like I said I need to take a break. Eat something. The dangers of the hunt require quality gear. What but here I thought the campfires here. Oh, it's there, here. Lander. Stupid me. By the way, let's. How many side quests do I have by now? Just one. Errands is way too much. So, yeah. So, yeah. Let's stop. Whoa, what is this? Oh, for a second, it looked like a giant cro crocodile. No. Um, look how cool the tall neck looks walking around back in there. It is the same area we were before, right? Yeah, it was the same. Because it's the satellite dish. 
so nice, man. It's over there. Can I see anything big moving? Nope, I can't. Man, man, man. Oh my god. This game is way too huge. I already can tell, man. This. Look how much. There are at least three, four more areas, man. One, two, three, four. Oh, fuck me, man. Well, not fuck me. Theoretically, it's amazing. It's just, as you might know, it's Elden Ring is coming and I need to play the day one. I need to know everything about Elden Ring, but it's neither here nor there. Either way, let's start this episode here. If you enjoy it, if you are curious what with those guys is, curious about everything, man. Will Elios be the savior at the end or will she become the bitch, man? Let's find out together. Stick around. And I'll see you next time. Until then, have a good one, guys.